Hello everyone, welcome back to another episode of Moonlighter. Um, we're not going to open the shop right now. Wait a minute, I need to check something. How? We are empty. Let's talk to the blacksmith because he has a couple of awesome things for us. Uh, hey, you must be well now. The one who requested my forge. Uh, yeah, that was me. My name is Andre, forge master extraordinary. If it's weapons or armor you seek, Falcon's Forge is the place. Hey, and we got some money. But the thing is, he doesn't only need money, he also needs items, as you can see right there. So the first thing we are going to save up for is probably... We already have this one. Uh, that's a big sword. Not sure if I want the big sword. This one is golden, though. Like a bow. A bow is good because then you can add a wish list. There we go. So now, all the items that we uh, pick up, if it has a star, we know it's there for. I'm ignoring that that potion person, by the way. Uh, if it has a star, we know it's for the upgrade that we just wish listed. And I really want that bow. So let's hop in and see if we can find all the stuff that we need. To get the bow. I'm a ranged player. I am. So. We want that. Now let me see. Um, we cannot check our inventory right now. But we can right now. And there's a star there. You see? So we know we need those for oh my god oh my goodness for not dying that's what, what we need it for why is there still a jelly on me why is there still a jelly on me right so we are almost dead um i'm gonna head back and heal up <laughs> don't worry we're gonna head back into the dungeon as well but i wanted to to, to keep these stuff So we are going to put it in our chest. We're not going to save. We're not going to sleep. We just want to put it here. Every, uh, everything in there. Great. So the way I'm seeing it right now is we don't really... What I can do is dungeon store, dungeon store. But let's just do a couple of dungeon runs. To get some stuff in our inventory to see if we can actually get all the stuff that we need for some upgraded gear and then save up for the amount of money that we actually need for that gear so then we can sell stuff and we can sell in bulk because we will have a lot of stuff to be to be sold at that point i think that's actually a pretty good way to approach the situation we are in right now Right, don't you agree? Yeah, we, we also need twigs. We don't need these things though. So they they can go. Why did you hit me? Why in the name of everything that's holy did you hit me? We got another uh, book here. So I was attacked by a moving rock today. Can you imagine a rock that moves? I did what any sensible person would do in this situation. I smacked it right back. It shattered upon the ground, leaving behind a stone heart. A core, as we come to call it. It's one of the many unique treasures that can only be found in this dungeon. Dropped by a guard unique to only this dungeon. I have to say, each of these dungeons have a very particular environment. A culture all its own. That is true. He's um, referring to... The other dungeons. This one is actually some sort of ruined dungeon, so to speak. Uh, the second one I know has to do with a deserty environment. So let's get rid of the shooter, let's get rid of the hitter, let's get rid of this slimy bit. Give me everything. Now we got some stuff that has a star. 
another note. What does it say? Why? Why do our tools keep disappearing? Chambers full of precious stone. Yeah. We already, we already read that one. It's fine though. I'm not heading into the boss fight yet. I kind of want to check out what's left on this floor. Or right, basically. Because we already went to the left side. Oh, I did not see you in the corner. That's you in the corner. It's you in the spotlight, losing my religion. Great. Lenses. We, we eventually need all the stuff, though, for an upgrade, so... Okay. The thing... We need to be wary of the stuff that we pick up and that we save and that we sell. Because not everything... That's not entirely true what I'm saying. Um, we will have to sell a lot of things eventually to get the money. But we also have to carry stuff. That really looked like an hourglass. We have to carry stuff for our upgrade, so... Can I just decide to, hey, let's keep this one? Because it might be worth a lot of money. Also, I hate these slimes. I hate these slimes, I say. Move. All right, Mr. Hand. I know what you, uh, what you were up to. Trying to get me to lose my stuff. See, and this is why I like ranged attacks, because of his attacks. I also should use my uh, my dodge movement a lot more than I'm currently doing. Sure, move that there. Let's see what's in this room. We can handle these. And I don't think I will actually go to the boss fight, because we are really, really weak still. That's what I mean. We're almost dead. I don't want to use a healing potion right now, so I am moving back to town and see if we have collected enough for our bow upgrade. Because if we do, then we just need to sell some other stuff. Alright, so let's pick up some stuff here. At least the ones we need. Do we have everything that we need? I wonder. Probably not. But there's only one way to find out. Uh, you look well today, Will. What can I do for you? Well, to be honest... We don't have enough. We need 10 sticks. And some of that sand things. Okay, let's empty our pockets. Let's head back into the dungeon because this is my goal for this episode. I want that bow. I want that bow. Sticks and sand, that's what we need. And then later on we will sell the stuff to see if we can actually buy it. But right now, it's stuff collecting time. Thanks. And the thing with these weapons is, you will notice later on, once we uh, proceed more in this game, the thing with these weapons is that there are upgrades, but they split up. So eventually you can get a better bow that does more damage, or one that does the same amount of damage, but also inflicts poison. So those are more decisions that you have to... Okay, you're shooting me have to take um, in consideration. Really? Can we jump this gap? We can. Should we jump this gap? I don't know. This one is new. It's not new. Also immediately there, the boss fight. Did you see that glistening there? That's a thing.
we can now, this is perfect. Now, what, whatever we put in this chest gets sent home. That's why this, this glistening thing is, is so great. And um, it's only a one-time thing, though. The chest disappeared now. But it's fine. Oh, man. Every freaking time. Every freaking time. You dash into me, and then we end up in... Oh, also, do you see that up there? I said the second one was desert deserty like, right? It's not true. What did we pick up here? What is this? From the wear of their bodies, I would have to say these golems have been fighting here for centuries. Whatever power supplies them must be darn near infinite. Uh, we picked up a training spear. Honestly, I don't know what it does. I, I don't see any... Uh, but hey, yeah, no, this is this is what the second dungeon will look like. It's, it's actually this. Uh, a foresty area. With enemies that are a lot harder to uh, fight than... Didn't really pick up the stuff that we wanted. But we are almost dead. Also, I'm not sure if the spear, since it's a, a straight attack, is better than the sword at this point. Can you give me back that little thing? I can still attack him. Boy, we need some healing, man. And we're not carrying any health potions at all. So let's check this room. If I don't like it, eh, this one is fine. This one is fine. It's not that hard. All right. But I do want the other stuff, you know? Like this, this stuff. Oh boy. Uh, we need to... Uh, we need to put that there. We need Basically, we need to put that there. And we need to put this one there, so it doesn't destroy anything. That's a good hole. So what's in this room? Another note. Journal. They're like moths. Like moths to the flame, I tell you. These adventurers. So many attracted to the dungeons. So many to only feel the burn. Luckily, if you pass out in the dungeon from exhaustion or pain, it spits you out eventually. It's a messy ordeal. No one really knows what happens. But one eventually wakes up outside the dungeon. With only small traces of slime nearby and... Well, any injuries they may have accumulated inside. Yes, some have left the dungeons to never return, but plenty have stuck it out. Many enjoy the thrill of the fight, many looking for that big payday. There really is so much more to these dungeons, though. You know what, let's head out. We're done here. This pendant is amazing. Do we have all the stuff that we need for the bow? I don't think so. I think we need a lot more twigs. But what we will do... Why is there a berry? Flying golem made to collect materials and repair golems with them. Is that an egg that we found? Yeah, this chest is full. <laughs> oh boy, this chest is full. But we still need a lot more twigs. That's the only thing we need. Twigs. Can we get some twigs, please? Kind of one. Hey, are you? 
Sort of always wanted to become a merchant, but I could never find a pendant. Most pendants used today were found when the dungeons were first discovered. Since then, finding a new one has become nearly impossible. I got one. Yeah, da, 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 and I found one in the dungeon. Da, 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 da. I cannot have it. It's mine. Right, give me some twigs, man. I need that bow. I really want that bow. But why is this loading screen so dang long? Great. Oh, I forgot I'm not using my sword. Do you have twigs? Or you just have grass or something. Twigs. More twigs. How much do we have? Four. So we need three more, I guess. We have three in the chest. No, no, no. Not gonna happen. Not today. Not today. So, Hand, what do you have for me? This spear actually isn't that bad, though. Some more stuff. What is this? Artifact remains hidden while currently in dungeon. Okay, that's fine. I mean, we can eventually try and fight the boss. That's not the end of it, though. That will just bring us to the, the second level. And I think there's... Okay, I can only hit you when you're dazzled. I think there's three levels, if I recall correctly. To so every dungeon. Each with their own boss, who gets more difficult the deeper you get into the dungeon. More twigs. We got the twigs. We can safely leave and get the bow. We can do that. Which might not be a bad idea, though. It might not be a bad idea at all. I mean... The series will last when the ser while the series will last, you know. We got some rocks out of that. The series will stay here. Doesn't matter if we play an extra episode or not. So why not go out, get the stuff, sell the stuff even, to get to 4K because that's what we needed, if I recall correctly. Um... So I don't want to sell, I don't want to sell you, I don't want to sell you, I don't want to sell you. White stone. Crystal rock. Um, yeah, you know what, let's keep it at this. And see where all this stuff actually lies. Vine was two. This one was five. All right, let's get some money. Let us get some money. Pretty sure you'd like that one. Oh, that's still cheap. You want... Oh, those crystals are also still cheap. Dang. That's not a good sign. All right, let's put in some more stuff then. Water lamp. So that's 150. Let's let's put the water lamp on 200 then. Or no. 180. Yeah, and and this one was 5. I'm happy with that. Anything needs to be sold. Anything that we can sell needs to be sold. So we can buy the bow. I really want the bow. Okay, the water lamp, way too cheap. Water lamp, way too cheap. But now we know, right? 
Now we know this one. Let's put it at 90. Since 85, way too cheap. That one, 90. Yeah, that was okay. This one, fabric. Like if 180 is way too cheap for the water lamp, then the fabric will be worth at least 210, 20. I don't know. We'll see. We'll see what it will sell for. And if we sell these stuff, we can buy the Bowman, then we got 4K. 4K is a good thing. Yeah, you're happy with the, the stones right now, so 90 is a good price. Thank you. What else do we have? Do you guys want something? You want a jelly? Can you handle the jelly? I don't think you're ready for this jelly. If you like it, you should have put a ring on it. I, really? It's still too cheap? It's still too cheap? We can buy the bow, though. It's still too cheap. Let's put it at... Oh... Yeah, let's put that at... Uh, at least 250, then. And this... 100 was okay. Hardened steel is also pretty expensive. The empowering crystal. I don't know, 50? Let's try that then. The water sphere. Seventy? Maybe seventy-five? Yeah, let's try that then. Can we sell... Uh, no, can we buy the bow when it's dark outside? I don't know. We will figure that out very soon then. Okay, the, the crystals? Way too cheap, still. Way too cheap. So these, well, these. Way too cheap at 50. Let's put them at 70. Vines were okay. Broken swords were okay. And uh, I'm gonna close the shop right now. Yeah, we earned a lot of money. Okay, so let's pick up the stuff that we want to pick up. Which is this, this. And this. You know what, let's get that one too. Go outside and buy the bow. And then at least we made some awesome progress. I hope that I can actually buy it here. We can. See, we buy a standard bow and then we can turn it into this one or that one. So now we get a plus 15 attack. This is a plus 35 attack and this is a plus 30, but also a stun or something. We only had... Okay. We didn't need 4K. We just needed the thousands. But at least now... We have a bow, which we will we'll equip there. Uh, I don't want to wishlist it anymore. So you can turn it off from the... Remove it from the wishlist. But we do want to wishlist... See, this makes us faster. It also gives us more HP. This one gives us more HP. That one gives us a lot more HP. We are going to save up for that one. 
that's that's gonna be a thing definitely so yeah it's time to empty the pockets empty the pockets you still need that that weird sand stuff but that's fine all right so that's another episode of moonlighter if you like what you're seeing please leave a like on the video it helps me out a lot and if you want to see more videos like this one please subscribe to the channel also there's a link down in uh, the description to our net discord a wonderful community where you would probably want to be part of. Anyways, thanks for watching and I will hope to see you next time.